Hello everyone! In this video we are going to do a very simple math problem and you are going to be surprised that many of you are actually going to get this wrong. So why don't you use your calculator right here? So here is the problem. 8 divided by 4 and in parentheses 1 plus 3. So as you can see no huge numbers, no squares, cubes right here. So what is the answer to this problem? Of course most of you out there are like, yes I can handle this. This is basic, I can handle this problem. This is basic division, basic multiplication, basic addition. I can easily solve it. So what is the answer? Right now I say suggest you to put your answer down in the comment section, what do you think is the correct answer, right here we have option A, B, C, so write your option down in the comment, it will be really interesting to check our answer in the end of the video, I'm going to show you the correct answer here in just one minute and we will check our answer, ok? So because obviously whatever order you select is going to create a different answer, right? Should we do division first, then multiplication, then this parenthesis, or maybe should we add this uh, 1 plus 3 first, then multiply, then multiply, then divide, yeah, it's a really interesting topic, because obviously whatever order you select is going to create a different answer, right? So we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem, and for this question I have this Bodmas order of operation and PMDAC, so two main popular order in the world nowadays, ok? So Bodmas and PMDAC order. As you can see, one really interesting moment, two methods to order of operation have the first stem step, because we have brackets in the Bodmas, so we start with parentheses in Bodmas, and PMDAC we start with these parentheses, yeah? So we need to start from these parentheses, but one really interesting moment, because we have a little bit difficult difference between these methods, so what method we prefer in our case? So I want to answer, ok, Bodmas is the old one, because it, this method is 100, has 100 years old, so this is the old one, and PMDMC, this is most popular order of operation nowadays, a lot of internet libraries, scientific calculator, graphing calculators work according to PMDFC. So we, we take away this Podmas and we have PMDFC order of operation. So according to this PMDFC and moreover to Podmas, as I, as, as I showed before, so we have parentheses as a first step. So I write 8 divided by 4 and 1 plus 3 in parentheses, yeah? So according to both method, to both order of operation, we need to start from these parentheses right here. So let's do this. So 1 plus 3 in parentheses give us, give us 1 plus 3 equal to 4, yeah? And we have from the beginning, so 8 divided by 4 and right here multiplying, yeah? So from, from this expression we have this one. So we skip this step, we do this in parentheses, ok. The next one is exponents, so are there any exponents, squares, cubes right here? No, I don't see any of those, so this is really great. Then we have multiplication and division, but a lot of students do this mistake, they think, ok, multiplication, let's start with multiplication, and they say, ok, 4 times 4 equal to 16, and you will have like 8 divided by, by 16, it looks like 1 half. So they say, okay, option A is correct, but why you you start from this? Uh, why do you start from this multiplication? Because one really interesting moment, multiplication and division. This is one group and really important moment because this is different order, yeah. Difference with the orders because if you start from multiplication, you will have sixteen. If you start from division, you will have completely different answer, right? So this order is incorrect. You cannot start with this multiplication because multiplication is division. This is one group, and you you need to scan. Ok, are there any uh, division and multiplication sign? Yeah, I have this multiplication division sign and don't, don't look with this multiplication that it is on the right hand side, you need to scan what is the first sign from left to right. Ok, you scan, yeah, right here, from left to right. The first sign from left to right is this division, yeah? So we need to start from this division at first. Ok, 8 divided by 4 equal to 2 and 2 times 4, the last step equal to 8. Yes, yeah, so as you can see, if you start from multiplication, you will have you get one half, which is option A. But if you start from this division, you will have option option C, eight. Yeah. So two different answer when you start with with multiplication and with division. But as I told before, multiplication and division is one group, and division is the first sign from left to right. So we need to start from this division and. This approach is incorrect, one half is absolutely incorrect answer. So just forget this explanation, forget this approach. I hope you understand this explanation, I hope your answer is the same as mine. You can easily check this answer into in like scientific graphing calculator, it will be really interesting because a lot of countries, a lot of approaches and it will be really interesting. What about this question in your country, what do you think is a correct, correct answer? My answer is option 
Option C is is eight. What about you? Write a question, write a suggestion down in the comment section. So we definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. Okay, now if you need to learn basic math, interesting brain test, IQ question, if you're struggling with pre-algebra concept, you can easily subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. I definitely wish you all the best in your mathematic adventure. Thank you for your time and have a great day.